Hello everyone, Josh Powers here with Quixel. As most of you know, we recently released Mixer 2020, which introduced 3D texturing among many other fantastic new features. This release is one of our biggest ever and we are absolutely blown away at all the astonishing work that's already coming out of the art community. From the beginning, one of the major goals we had with Mixer was to create something that was both powerful and robust, yet was incredibly user friendly. And based on the feedback we've been receiving, we're very excited to hear that we're on the right track to hitting those goals. However, we do know that understanding the ins and outs of a tool is absolutely vital to being able to produce your best work. So to help you understand Mixer even better, we'll be releasing a new series of short video tutorials with each one dedicated to a specific feature inside Mixer. And to kick things off, we're going to start with the mass stack components and modifiers. From curvature components to posterized modifiers, We'll be going over several of the options available to use in the mass stack in great detail to help you get a better understanding of just how they work and how you can get the most out of each one. We'll explain their functionality as well as how each of the settings within the component work. We'll also give some practical examples of how they can be used in the texturing process so that you can create stunning texture maps quickly and with ease. Besides offering robust and easy to use tools, our goal here at Quixel is to empower artists, freeing them from the bonds of technical limitations and frustrations, and allowing them to keep their focus on their craft. Our hope with these video tutorials is that by giving you a deeper understanding of how Mixer works, that your experience will be better each time you use it. If there are some areas of Mixer you would like to see us focus on, please feel free to leave those requests in the comments below, and we'll do our best to address them sometime in the future. We hope you enjoy these videos and that you're able to learn a lot from them. Thanks for watching and let's get started. 